So everything that we've done in this section up to this point, so the Facebook page, the FAQ page, and securing your site, I would say are absolutely essential. You really should implement those three things. But in this lecture, I wanna give you some things that are not necessarily essential on day one, but that you might want to implement in the future when your business is more up and running. So please don't get bogged down in these things right now. It's just there to whet your appetite and get you thinking about how you might add further credibility six months or so from now. So this first suggestion is to implement some sort of live chat. I've no doubt you've been on some sort of site where at some point a little thing has popped up and said, how can I help you? Well, that's kind of what TDO Live Chat and many other live chat apps can do for you. Now, live chat is great, but of course you then need to be responsive. You know, if you type something in and nobody replies, then in some ways that decreases credibility. So you need to be able to react. But having said that, these types of apps also allow the user to see that actually at the moment you're offline and basically you then get a message a bit later on. Now that's not ideal, you would prefer to be more reactive, but at least you're getting something, at least you have the opportunity to build that relationship. And then you can grow, you know, as you basically build, you might want to get a virtual assistant, a VA, to be there to answer your questions. Or you might say to yourself, well, do you know what, I'm basically here anyway, most of the time, so I will be able to answer these questions, at least for those potential customers within my time zone. Now, the other thing you might want to do is to include a telephone number on your site so that people can call you. Now, this needs some careful thought because if they call you, clearly they want to have some sort of response or some sort of answering system. So please don't be tempted to use your own mobile telephone number. That will make it very, very difficult to manage your business and probably at best you'll look fairly unprofessional. But you could get a Skype in number for a very small fee, or you could use services like this Grasshopper site where you can basically get a business telephone number that you can then put on your site and you get all kinds of other functionality with this as well, allowing you to do things like leave voicemails, etc. So there we go, just a quick lecture, as I said before, to whet your appetite. I really don't think from day one you need to worry about live chat or even contact telephone numbers on your site, as I said. But certainly as you grow, let's say once you get past perhaps $5,000 a month, I would certainly consider building the credibility of your site by providing services such as these.